It's all fail, 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 and then succeed. Lies. Lies uh, on lies on Liza Benelli. No. Nope. <laughs> hmm. Who came up with this thing? Seriously. Entrepreneurs are born. You can't get involved if you aren't born into it. Rubbish. Rubbish. Entrepreneurs are made when you meet other entrepreneurs. So I think it's that simple. Entrepreneurs are mainly motivated to get rich. <laughs> That's the only reason they start a business. Um, no, 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 no. That's not, that's definitely not how that works. Entrepreneurs aren't ethical. They're just ruthless and deceptive. <laughs> Who wrote this again? <laughs> May I know? Because it's pretty rude. Entrepreneurs will get me back complete control over my schedule. You have no schedule whatsoever. Forget this. All entrepreneurs are born with wealth and everyone uses their family money to start companies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you love so much. <laughs> Such a lie. Who's writing these? <laughs> Entrepreneurship is fun. It's always fun. Okay. It is fun. I think it's much more fun to be an entrepreneur than to be working even when it sucks. So. It's fun and it sucks and it's fun and it sucks, but the fun part outweighs the sucks part. Entrepreneurs are young. You'll never have the energy to get started if you let in the career. Uh, well, I'm not young anymore, so that's actually nothing not true, I think. There's no need to get a full education or on the flip side, entrepreneurs can only be successful if you graduate with a degree. Entrepreneurship doesn't require a degree. I think it's something that is embedded in you. It's a feeling. It's a risk-taking attitude that even if you don't have bachelor's or master's, you would definitely be able to do it if you just have it within you. Entrepreneurs don't quit until they succeed. They never fail. Oh, it's all fail, 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 and then succeed. And it's like you fail a hundred times until you succeed and it looks like overnight success, but then actually you've you know, failed like a bazillion times before. Entrepreneurs get started because they have some extra time and you need a second income. I need a first income first. Like, I don't have my first <laughs> income, forget the second income. Yeah, I agree with her. Entrepreneurs start a company because they're desperate, since they can't find a job that suits them. Um, maybe some entrepreneurs are completely unemployable, it's possible. But again, it's a massive stereotype. I think most entrepreneurs uh, have skills that are usable and just aren't finding the match of their purpose. Men are natural entrepreneurs because women just are better suited to be employees. I don't know if this is supposed to like, just make me mad or, <laughs> um, okay. You know how I feel about this already, I don't need to <laughs> like watch my feminism side come out. Women won't be strong entrepreneurs, especially when they start having children. <laughs> okay, so I started my first business before I had a kid, then I had a kid, then I started my other business, and then I had more kids, and now I have six. And I think um, the reason why I like my lifestyle is because I have that many children, and I, because I feel that I can give my kids a great example and a great education by being an entrepreneur. Entrepreneurs refuse to work with others and just want to do it all themselves. We are control freaks. I have to admit, we are control freaks. But yeah, but it takes a village. It takes a whole village, <laughs> y'all. No, or just two. It's insane. Listen, the thing with these things, I feel like you're stronger when you're a unit, when you come exactly. as a village. And it's amazing how we're always bouncing ideas off of each other, learning from each other, we balance each, each other's other, strengths yeah. and weakness, weak, weaknesses. Weaknesses. Strengths and weaknesses. Weaknesses. Sorry, Wink. I'm still stuck at that. Entrepreneurs are tired of working hard and being so stressed all the time. Actually, I think that's probably true. I think entrepreneurs are tired. I think they do work all the time. I think they're pretty stressed. Um, but obviously they've made a calculation and figured out that the equation works. So they'll just keep doing it. Because the alternative is not as great. 